Hey, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you may be. Craig at Hiking Pipes. And this is a VR out to Zippo 765, Derek. And uh, Derek is having a gaw in celebration of his subscriber mark. And so congratulations, Derek, and thank you for doing this gaw. So for a uh, little housekeeping on this one, I'm smoking my Jack Ryan. This is number 28. It has a beautiful rustication with some flame grain underneath and this uh, green and black German ebonite stem. Did beautiful work on this. The uh, rim has some nice uh, bird's eye to it. And in it, smoking some McBaron, whoop, with some glare, navy flake. So, what Derek has asked us to talk about for this gaw is what is our lighting method for our pipes? As you just saw, my lighting method is a Zippo lighter. So I have uh, three Zippos. Uh, this one I use probably most often. This is an Armor one. It uh, has this beautiful mountain and moon engraving. It has kind of a, uh, a knurl type of top and uh, they, it, this goes all the way around. It's a, I really like this lighter a whole lot. So uh, I use this one mostly. I also have my first Zippo lighter which was this gray matte one with a red border. I got this over uh, probably about close to 35 years ago. And I mean, it's in phenomenal shape and it's been through the mill. Um, I got this when I first started to get into the pipe world or I tried to smoke pipes and uh, it was a disaster for me because I didn't know what I was doing. Uh, so I ended up kind of giving it up in a short time, but uh, I've used this lighter and 10,000 other applications and uh, it's just it's it's in remarkable shape no issues my probably uh, my most well not probably it is my most special lighter is this one here if there's a little glare here this lighter um, my wife had given me for our 25th wedding anniversary and it has a custom engraving on it saying Craig 25 years of love with a love always Deborah. So my most special lighter. So yes, I only have three, but uh, I use the Zippos um, as I've kind of indicated uh, because especially on days like today where it's a little breezy out, um, I find that uh, butane lighters like Bix and even some higher end ones like Zycars and so forth uh, just can't stand the wind and matches. I really find them almost virtually useless uh, if there's any kind of breeze out. Yeah, they they Zippos work first time every time. The only downside to them is that yes, um, you have to uh, replenish the fuel perhaps a little more often. Um, you know, I toggle back and forth between, you know, Ronsonol and uh, Zippo lighter fuel uh, right now. Um, yeah, they're the same thing. I did a test on these and they're virtually the same uh, fuel. But that's the only downside to a Zippo is that perhaps you just got to be more cognizant of your fuel level in a lighter, especially if you're going to be taking it on like a vacation somewhere and... Uh, you just may, like I said, want to make sure it's filled up and, you know, if it's going to be more than a week of use, uh, you know, have provisions, uh, you know, in case. And I usually carry a big lighter just for that purpose is just strictly as a backup in the event that uh, I'm stupid enough. And I wasn't paying attention to my fuel level and I go to light and uh, I'm out of fuel. So um, anyway. So what Derek is doing or providing for this gaw, as I've been rambling about Zippo lighters and stuff, uh, Derek is uh, giving away a brand new Jack Ryan pipe, and it's beautiful. And I can attest owning two Jack Ryan pipes myself. 
this one, and number 24, um, that Jack is doing some really phenomenal work. Uh, again, I, I've said it before on a just a previous video where I was, you know, talking about this particular pipe. But, uh, you know, he does, they don't come with a lot of bells and whistles and, you know, fancy metals and materials. But what they are are just really well-made pipes. They smoke great. The drilling is spot on. Um, the fit and finish are very, very good. Um, like on this one here, I can't even feel the, a seam where the stem meets the shank. It's... and. Those are the real important things about a pipe, I feel. I mean, yes, there are prettier pipes out there, uh, although this one's quite nice. Um, but uh, these are just good, solid pipes, and I really super enjoy smoking them. So anyway, I want to thank uh, Derek again for sort of doing this gaw and wish him congratulations. And uh, with that, I will just say, as always, be well. Be safe, and most importantly, be good to one another, and we'll see you again very soon. Thanks, and take care. Bye-bye.